Hello everyone, this is Leaf on the Win, uh, bringing you Mission 3 of Chapter 2, Solidarity. The Initiative can't take this kind of development lying down. May I assume that you are immediately available for this quest? It's astounding that you, as a non-scientist, should have become so very important to us. Um... I don't know if that's an insult or not, but as you can see there, we're being joined by Yana and Rufus again as representatives of the two major factions. And basically the whole job of this mission is we have to find proof that Father's, you know, completely insane, uh, being a cult leader and all, and plans to destroy the world. Because, you know, that's what viruses normally do to advance AI, convince them to destroy the world. And let's go. Oh god, more red lights. No! The city is just one big battlefield! The computer virus must have totally crippled Father's security routines. Otherwise, it could never have gone this far. Okay. Who's fighting who? Seriously. Who is, are the scientists all rioting out there? Oh god! <laughs> there goes that plane. The situation is grave. I fear SAAT needs the assistance of Global Trust and the Eden Initiative. Their representatives are due to arrive soon. What gave you that idea that you need their help? Not the fact that your leader abandoned you and destroyed your city. <laughs> oh god. I feel sorry for them on so many levels. So, Father. The infallible Super AI is out of control? Well, that is certainly regrettable. But it's not Global Trust's problem. You're right, it's not your problem until it affects you, correct? We still don't know where Father is, but there are people injured in the city's ruins who need our help. I can't chase a phantom when people are in danger here. You know, that probably makes the most sense. The hippie's worried about the people. Global Trust is just, just there to be like, well, make sure it doesn't affect the business. Clean this up. Father is totally out of control! Miss Rodriguez and Mr. Thorne are underestimating the threat. We must find a way of making them realize the danger. All right. Speak to them both again. They seem to trust you. Maybe they'll listen to you. I seriously met these two people like 45 minutes ago. Well, maybe about two hours game time, but probably 45 minutes real time. I have no idea why they would even trust me. Seriously. I'm at your immediate disposal. Alright, let's contact him. The short version. Okay. I understand Professor Davies' agitation, but he's making a mountain out of a molehill. And catching his runaway AI is not within the scope of my responsibility. Well, I tried. Time to give up. Everything okay? What do you want? No, what do you want? Sorry, but the most support the Eden Initiative can provide is to help rebuild CORE. Unless there is proof that Father is planning an attack, we would rather focus on more important things. He's a rogue supercomputer that's bent on, well, God knows what. I have no idea why you people aren't, like, first on this. Well, you tried. But we need some more persuasive arguments. Maybe Dr. Bartok has been able to find something out. I doubt it. There is no clear evidence in the city of what Father is planning. But I have received a distress call from an island very near here. Okay. Let's go explore that island. Alright, let's make sure everything's working on my island first, and seems to be actually pretty well. How's my guys doing here? They still want to upgrade, so they'll do it as they get carbon. My guys here... Am I running out of fish still? Oh, my hope I make a road over there. Oops. Wrong key. Warning. Production halted. Hmm. Oh, there's Mayday. the island. Mayday! 
This is Lester from the Bradford Mine. Our energy supply is down. We need an emergency team here. Over. Okay. Dr. Bartok has identified these posts as the source of the distress signal. We must check to see if anyone has survived. Gotcha. You're alive. I was afraid we were the only ones. We need to reactivate our energy supply, but our uranium pellets have been stolen. Wow, sucks to be you. I know a way of tapping the deeper uranium deposits, but there's a little preparation to do first. Well, gotta go develop a uranium drill. And while I'm at it, uranium drill bit, I'm gonna make an er emergency equipment. Probably gonna need it here, um, just in case my, you know, oil platform explodes. Which is possible. The drill bits and like sand filters and stuff will in if you put them on your island and upgrade slot and run them, they'll increase the amount that's available on the island. So in this case, let's say we're running out of basalt, even though I have plenty of it, like seriously enough to last me for years. Um, let's just say I'm running out of it. I would make a basalt cutter head. Uh, put it in my upgrade slot, run it, and the quantity would go from zero to 7,200. Take five minutes to do, clearly, but, you know, you get the idea. Okay, uranium drill. Oh god, I actually have to colonize the place. Yeah, that looks good. Let's go shove down a warehouse over here. Energy supply inadequate. How horrible. There. Once we have uranium, we can restore the energy supply to the computer center. Then we'll also receive reports of the latest events. Awesome. So I need three uranium delivered to his warehouse. And I already have plenty of it. Let's go drop it off. Were you really able to do something for me? Energy again, at last. Excellent. We have energy. Thank you for turning out to According to these reports, useless. the uranium has actually been loaded into Father's ships. Tell Rufus Thorne. I'm trying to find out what Father intends to do with it. Wow. All right, he, the guy said that the uranium, uranium was stolen. There's a rogue AI out there, and it's like, Father took it! What a shock! I have no idea why that's a shock. All right, so we did that. Now we get to go Look who's tell back. Rufus. What can Global Trust do for you? Have you any evidence at all that Father is plotting something? Come on, I'm listening. Theft of uranium, you say? That is no trivial offense. On the other hand, it doesn't justify a large-scale operation. I can, at worst, make an insurance claim. <laughs> so he stole some uranium, so at worst he's going to make a dirty bomb. So we better put, out, put insurance on all, all of our buildings, so when they all get nuked back to the Stone Age, um, we can get the money back. The evidence is shocking, particularly for SAAT. I hope you'll help us bring Global Trust and the Eden Initiative onto our side. Gotcha. Global Trust has a small fleet nearby. If it makes you feel safer, I can place them at your disposal. But you'll have to bear the costs. I'll think about it. Hmm, we will hold off on that here. All right, let's go to this island now. The level of environmental pollution in the north and northeast areas is measured from here. It looks like Father was here before us. Are those hostile? Yeah, they are, as it turns out. Okay, I gotta deal with those. It's one of SAAT's GPS radio stations. If Father has passed by here, maybe we can find out where he has gone. Position matching completed. Result? Approach corridor to GPS radio station is located outside the ordinance range. 
All right, we're going to have to deal with that. Warlike activities. Loading standard protocol. Rice 98. In case of war. Warlike behavior. A rogue AI takes off, steals uranium, and then we're being attacked by the turrets he put in place. Yeah, that's a little warlike there. All right, well, let's do what it takes here to get me a good fleet, which I guess... You, go back on your trade route. So, 10 tons building material, 10 tons iron. You know, I'm just taking all of it because I need to place down warehouses here. Except not that one. I have no iron. We're going to have to go get some iron. We'll get it from this guy. He's useful. Do you have a scientific interest? Just uh, drop by if you need anything else. Sorry, I gotta go warmongering here Warning. for a minute. Production breakdown. Why aren't you running? Actually, that's a really good question. Why isn't that running? Oh, there's no energy. Why is there no energy around here? Whatever. Shove down a windmill. There we go. There, now they're running at peak efficiency. We'll check on these other islands first and find out what they want while I'm waiting for the uranium to come around. That appears to be an abandoned global trust oh, post. That doesn't and look good. Those are father's units. But what is there to monitor out here? Sadly, you are right. Peaceful means will achieve nothing here. Okay. We'll deal with that in a minute. We should be passing an Eden Initiative base any moment now. It, wait, something's wrong. Perhaps we should investigate. What could possibly be wrong? It's lucky you found us. Our central panel and shields are down and we have nothing to repair them with. Sounds like your problem. Dang it, he's going to make me deliver stuff too. Man, who doesn't want me to go on a fetch quest right now? No, I don't want you running. That's why I wasn't getting uranium. Gotcha. Alright, 5 tons carbon, 10 tons functional drinks. Great. Wait, did I say functional drinks? I did say functional drinks. I thought they were energy drinks. Huh. That's interesting. Never noticed that. Oh, I have a feeling I'm never going to get those. Hmm. It's a problem. Oh, simple solution. Click on it. They won't. That level won't grab it anymore. So we'll have extra. Although we are having a problem with fish still. So I'm going to need more fish. Only solution. Drink supply inadequate. Oh, they're pissed at me. Innovation really is a foreign word in this city. <laughs> Aren't we all snotty? I need drinks for a reason. Uh, can I buy them from somewhere? The company expects results. I can buy carbon. Oh, over here, you must have drinks. No, you don't have anything. Nobody has drinks around here. Well, this is going to be a problem. I'm going to expand the drink. So, we're going to create more drinks. More and more drinks. Let's see if I can cram everything in here. Not quite. So that's a failure. Let's try a little bit up here. Time to make everything fit. P 
if you play Tetris and you're good at Tetris, you're going to be good at placing fields here before too long. Perfect. Complete success. Alright, now we have to do coffee, because everyone loves themselves some coffee. Should be able to cram everything in that. Perfect. And then we'll just shove the drink area, energy drink production over here. If I had any freaking carbon left. And I'll need more energy. Hmm, problematic. Alright, so that carbon factory got to get on the go. I need that fleet. Do I have enough? I do not have enough yet. It's a problem. Or even mine me more uranium. You have three. Why weren't you picking them up? Just connect you via road. Maybe I'll help. Seriously, why is that not being picked up? Warning. Production breakdown. Alright, I don't care about any of this. Pick it up. Perfect. There's that. Let's go get our extra fleet. Perfect. Have you completed the quest, Sack? Of course. Glo Perfect. Now he's going to give me some ships to increase my fleet, make an actual fleet compared to last game where it was just, you know, a single vessel. Perfect. And that should be able to last me while I build warehouses around this place. So somebody needs carbon, which I'm working on, and somebody needs drinks, which I'm also working on. Well, we will shove it right there. There. Go nuts. Where are my extra vessels? Up here. Well, how they just stack the boats on top of each other. That's not an issue or anything. Alright, let's go attack these. Clear it off and get it ready for putting a warehouse on it. Taking a little bit of damage there, Mr. Viper. Let's go get these guys healed before they all sink. And then we'll finish them off. How are we doing here? Oh, that's not what I wanted. Alright, we got carbon. We have some drinks, but not much. I might have to make another one. I don't really want to. You know what? These guys are no longer uh, allowed to have drinks for now. There, that should get it going. Warning. Production breakdown. What broke down? Smelter! I smelter again. Look at that ship. You can fix it's on fire. Still floating around. Way to go, command ship. Hardy little bugger. That's right. You heal up nice and good, and we're going to take you over there and clear out that island so I can find out what's going on over there. Alright, everyone assemble, and let's go. I can turn this back on, though. I don't know why I need it, but might need it for something. Alright, go my little fleet of destroying death. Excellent. And we'll 
bring you over here in preparations for ne the next one. Yeah, those drinks are being a little bit of a pain. What am I going to do about this? Yeah, I'll probably just let it do things while I'm hunting. Hunting down father's equipment. The data indicates that father was heading northeast when he came by here. I'm sure I can extrapolate his exact target coordinates. Excellent. I have extrapolated father's target coordinates. That's fast. It is actually a settled area. Notify Miss Rodriguez immediately. Alrighty. Now we get a bug Rodriguez or Yana. The board has its eye. Everything okay? Listen, I do believe you, but we mustn't stumble into this conflict blindly. I need some hard evidence, like father's position, for example, what a or information about his weapons and defensive systems. These coordinates are in a sector northeast of here, a settled area. Really? Maybe you're right, and father really is planning to launch an attack. Can you find out what technologies he has at his disposal? No. I'm done with this. I am finished. That's all I have to say. Alright, let's go attack a few of these little boats here. Uh oh, that guy's having some issues. Run, my little Your pretty... course of action is irrational. Oh, I'm losing ships. I'm gonna have to rebuild my fleet. It's problematic. Well, let's do it the easy way, then. Oh, God, everything needs iron. Everything needs iron. Well, that doesn't. Let's build a whole bunch of command ships. What am I doing? That one. There. Let's build five of them. I don't have quite enough, but we'll just let it build its thing. I got enough energy drinks yet? Not quite. See, this is kind of the most annoying part about this thing, is half the time just sitting around waiting for stuff to stock up. new vehicle. Excellent. Registering new vehicle. Vehicle completed. There, got everything. Send it on over. And you guys can have drinks back. You're welcome. Warning. Production halted. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, well. I only get three of these guys. Hmm. Hmm. This might be hard. Did you solve our problem? Yeah, I did. The central panel is online again, but the development database has been hacked. The data for our new shield technology is missing. Okay. So, Father has the Eden Initiative's shield technology. He does. Anna Rodriguez won't be happy when you tell her. Well, you better tell her then. I don't want her to be mad at me. She's hot. Except, not so, really. So, what's up? These coordinates are in a sector northeast of here. A so that's it. Father is planning his attacks from the Adol, and is protecting himself with our shield technology. So he has been working on his plan for quite a while. I'm not sure how you jumped to that conclusion, but that's alright. I'm glad you're on board. All right. Actually, can I get my submarine in there? I don't think I can. So we're just going to go ahead and attack. Because I'm stupid that way. Focus fire, people. Focus fire. I'm losing this engagement. Oh, well. More ships. How much do I have in the way of that? Iron. Vehicle None. Vehicle destroyed in battle. Oh, that's horrible. Horrible, I say. Hmm. Know exactly what I'm gonna do. 
don't know why I didn't think of this earlier. We're going to buy iron. All SAAT technologies are, of course, st so uh, I must uh, devote myself to organizational matters again. Yeah, like organizing while your cult leader took off and is going to destroy the planet. Perfect. And then we'll throw a, shove a command ship in there, and everything's all set. I don't know why I didn't think of that earlier. Oh, I'm a genius. What are going to do here, though? So I can put my warehouse Registry. there. New vehicle. Warning. Production breakdown. Nobody cares, Eve. Oh, I guess it is kind of important. Go, Registry. vehicle. New vehicle. And we'll get the command ship and we're all set. Vehicle completed. Bingo. Let's go hunting. Opening in the rock formation detected. Detecting underwater passage. Evasion of enemy turrets possible. What? I could get it in there. That's not okay. Nuclear warheads were stored here, but it looks like they've all been removed. I fear the worst. Oh god, I think I know what Father's doing. Don't have to be a scientist to figure that one out. Nuclear missiles! Oh my god! That's why Father has been monitoring the post. Let's hope Mr. Thorne will now believe the threat. Well, it depends. Can he buy and sell these nuclear weapons for a profit before they destroy humanity? Let's go find <laughs> out. <laughs> Look who's here! <laughs> ah, shut what up. brings you here? Theft of uranium, you say? That is no trivial offense. On the other hand, it doesn't just father has our missiles, you say. Our missiles? This is indeed alarming. I'll talk to the board about providing support. Come back later. Wait, so there are his nuclear missiles? Seriously? That's that's fantastic. The evidence is shocking, particularly for SAAT. I hope you'll help us bring Global Trust and the Eden Initiative onto our side. Okay, I've been convinced now that Professor Davy here is suffering from, I don't know, dementia or Alzheimer's or something like that, because that's the second time he told me about that. And then in the previous video, he told me four separate occasions, five separate occasions, how important it was the to have father. The board has its eye on you. Uh, okay. First uranium, then missile. Father does indeed seem to be preparing an attack. But I have good news from the board. Score. The board figured out I stole the missiles. Nobody gets away from stealing from Global Trust. Doesn't matter, he's basically a terrorist and cult leader, so yeah. He stole the missiles. Our missiles. We were supposed to be the ones to threaten the Your world. stubbornness has paid off. The executive board finds the latest developments in this father matter most alarming. Excellent. Tell Professor Davy that Global Trust will support him. Excellent. Great to see you. Father is turning into a serious threat. I'm on your side, so I've been putting some pressure on Eden headquarters. Successfully. Ha! Huh, well done. Pressure on Eden. Your evidence convinced my boss. If you would still like us to help, you can count on the Eden Initiative. And the diplomacy part of the tutorial is Thank you. good. You have done a good job. I will set up a teleconference with Miss Rodriguez and Mr. Thorne immediately. Excellent. Mr. Thorne, Miss Rodriguez, this situation is far more difficult for me than for you. Father was our highest authority. He has become dangerous, perhaps more dangerous than we can imagine. We must work together now. Actually, in the future, are there no nuclear weapons other than the ones Father just stole? Because once you find them, can't we just nuke them into oblivion?
Hey, that looks like something Your just happened. Your supercomputer has stolen weapons and resources from Global Trust and is threatening company sites wherever he can. This, of course, changes everything. The board has therefore agreed to a joint venture. <laughs> everything, everything with this guy is in some way business related. Well done. It's not that the guy's threatening terrorism or anything, it's the fact he stole the missiles. Our work here is almost done, so I have spoken to HQ and given them the new evidence. I have some good news. The Eden Initiative is joining this cooperative venture. And it's like, that's all, it's like, we're going to join the co-op to destroy Father. Well done. And there we go. And I won. That's mission three, final mission of chapter two. Uh, leave your comments below. Let me know what you think. And I will catch you all next time.